Hi everybody, Beanmeister22 here. Hey, today we're going to do something really cool. I'm going to show you a sneak peek of a very cool item, a sneak peek unboxing, and then I will show you something that is really cool and really weird. All right, so the first thing we're going to look at is a skeleton candle. This is a gummy bear skeleton candle. It looks like a giant gummy bear. I guess if you put this out with some of the giant gummy bears, maybe somebody would take a bite of it. That'd be funny. Except it's made of wax, and it's unscented wax, so it doesn't even smell like cherry or watermelon or something. I think that'd be cool if it did have a scent to it, and it'd really be like a gummy bear, but I think they were afraid of somebody accidentally trying to eat it. This is a skeleton candle. Now, if you wonder, what's a skeleton candle? I've heard of these before, but they had a cat and something, and then somebody pointed out to me, Hey, have you seen these? And I said, Hey, I haven't, but I'll get one. And I'm thinking it'll make a very cool video of us taking this out of the box and then lighting the wick on the top and then filming it burn all the way down because what you have inside of this is the secret. It's what makes it really cool. And it's really how you get the name. Inside of this skeleton candle, this gummy bear skeleton candle, inside is an aluminum gummy bear skeleton. So as you burn this down, you will start to see the skeleton. And when it's all the way burned down, you'll have a really cool gummy bear skeleton to leave up on the shelf. I told you it was kind of weird. And, well, the other one's even weirder, the thing we're going to look at next. But this is really cool. It says here it's made of wax and aluminum. Get it? Wax for the candle, aluminum for the skeleton. Well, that made sense, right? It also says this candle will burn for approximately 100 hours. I'm thinking, 100 hours? How in the world am I going to film it burning for 100 hours? Well, you know, I have an idea, and we will talk about that in another video. Now, if you go online on Amazon, which is where I purchased this, there'll be a link down in the description section of the video. If you go online at Amazon, you will see they are currently selling for $49.95 with free shipping. That's very cool, and it's well worth it. I've had this for a month or so, yeah, about a month, I don't remember, I bought it a month or so ago, and it was $55 then. $49.95 is a lot better than $55. And really, it's only $5.05, but that makes a difference. That's five bucks, you know, that's almost a cup of coffee of one of my fancy coffees that I drink and I stick my pinky out when I drink it. Very cool candle, and we will have a video where we're going to actually show what's inside of it. I just want to do this really quick unboxing. Now let's get to the, you think this is weird? Now let's get to what's really weird. This is a, you ready for this? This is a gummy bear. It's a gummy bear anatomy lesson thing. By 4D Master. It's a clear gummy bear anatomy. And you have this shell and then you have the innards of a gummy bear. So if you thought it was weird that we had a candle that had a skeleton of a gummy bear inside, this thing, it's got a skeleton, it's got a brain, it's got innards and guts and lungs and liver and esophagi and intestines. Oh my. Now on the package it says, funny anatomy, plastic model, gummy bear is 215 millimeters tall. Who the heck uses millimeters? Yeah, I know everybody else in the world except us uses millimeters. But on something this size, wouldn't you say centimeters instead of millimeters? Because, yeah, anyways. Easy to assemble, or it says easel, easy assemble. It wasn't hard to assemble, but it wasn't super, super easy. You know, the bones popped in, his finger bone, his hands, and his... You got them arm and shoulder bones to the rib cage. And his pelvis and leg bones, those wasn't hard, but what was hard is getting the guts all properly together and putting them up inside the rib cage. That was kind of difficult. And it says, highly detailed finishing. Let me just tell you right now, this is very cool. It's neat. I went online to get that skeleton candle, and this came up as an advertisement near it. I said, wow, I have got to get both of these things. Very, very weird, very, very unique, good conversation piece, something neat to bring to school. And it's a learning thing, because you get to see the guts and the bones and the skeleton, and you pop the top of the head off, and there's a brain in there. How cool is that? Yeah, okay, there's a brain in there. How weird is that? And it comes with this clear gummy bear shell thing on the outside, which helps you hold it all together. What I think would be neat is if we took this clear shell and we painted it a color so you know it was more of a gummy bear color on the outside and then you popped it off. But then you wouldn't get to see the cool anatomy stuff on the inside. So if you ever wondered what the inside of a gummy bear looked like before you ate it, well, this is what it looks like when it's alive before they turn it into 
gummy bear stuff that we eat. <laughs> it's kind of a neat idea. The skeleton candle, that's pretty cool too, and it's practical because you can use it as a candle. This is pretty cool, but this is also just pretty cool and weird because you can use it as a learning tool, learning aid to see stuff inside, anatomy and ribs and bones and guts and stuff, but really this is just weird. Now if you remember we talked about that skeleton candle costing between $49.95 and $55, this is only $25.07. As with everything else, I will put links down in the description section of videos. You can go check it out on Amazon. And they had a higher price there, 40 some dollars, slash down to 2507 Sometimes you see that and it's a sale. Sometimes you see it and it's just, look, at here's a big high price, but here's what we're selling it to you for. And that's the case with this. And if you remember, we talked about this in another video. I think that we found uh, an item or a toy that had one price and then it slashed. It was three cents cheaper and said, you save three cents. And I said, wow, that was more effort to write that than it is to save three cents. But this 2507 opposed to 40 some dollars. Yeah, it's a good deal. And this is really neat. So if you're a fan of gummy bears and things like that, you know, you've seen my videos with the big gummy bears. If you haven't, go check them out, because I have videos with five-pound gummy bears and, you know, the one-pound ones and gummy bear in a stick. And yes, I have the 27-pound gummy bear. I've had several of those. But really, that 27-pound gummy bear is just too big and weighs too much. There's no way you can eat it all, and then, yeah, yeah. But I say this in every gummy bear video, because people say, that's not the biggest gummy bear I've ever seen. Yes, I've seen all the size of the gummy bears, unless they come with one that's bigger than 27 pounds. I think we can make our own, right? So if you're a gummy bear fan or a gummy bear collector, today we looked at two really cool gummy bear things that you just got to have. You got to have that skeleton candle because it's really cool, it's a neat idea, and it's a candle. And then we have this gummy bear anatomy lesson thing with a gummy bear with a clear shell outside and all his guts in there. And it's really creepy looking in a weird, strange sort of way. Yeah, I don't know. Now, in my defense, I did say we're going to look at something pretty weird today, didn't I? <laughs> All right. So, have you seen either this or that skeleton candle before? They're two very cool gummy items. If you like gummy bears or love gummy bears or if you want to give a gift to somebody to, who likes gummy bears or how about somebody who hates gummy bears, either of these would be the perfect gift. If you have someone, oh, I hate gummy bears. <laughs> I got this gummy bear candle. Or, I hate gummy bears, so I got you something that looks like the inside of a gummy bear. That's just my sense of humor. You'll have to decide if you really want to do that or not. Okay, so I told you it'd be weird, and I it was, right? So leave your comments in the comment section. Hey, as always, thanks for watching. Hey, it's it's weird, but it's cool, right? Beanmeister 22, the most dangerous man on YouTube. <laughs>